back to another review of how this training is going and how's the training been going. I mean, there's been a few interruptions this week, namely DTS staff party. And yeah, it was a lovely party and I probably did eat a bit too much and did eat a little bit. And I probably did eat, drink a little bit too much, but all in all, it was a good party. We went to Stockdale Park, which that was a lot of exercise, having to do the skiing and the skating and the walking around, and that was good. So on to the training, I've got some riding done. I haven't actually been able to get to the swimming because yesterday I was due to go swimming, which was on Wednesday, and I didn't make it. And with the running, if you've been watching the news or you've even looked out your windows, you'd see that this weather, this weather's not up for it. It's not good. Truly, truly on with this training, but it's slowly, 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 slowly in increasing. I'm not gonna be going for it like mad. The diet's going all right. I mean, I could be eating a little better, slips up a couple of times, but you know, one slip doesn't make a, a massive issue, does it really, people? No. Um, so just readdressing that and getting that dealt with. We, we are on plan, we are, we are on plan. So what my plans are for the future is just to step it up a little bit. So my next step is to get the 400 meters done, get out of the swimming pool, go into the car park, get on my bike and ride home. I live about seven miles from the swimming pool. We ride home, that will be the beginning of my brick training. Yes, I do need help with getting my bike there. I'm sure I can find someone to help me. And then the next part of the brick training from there is riding my bike around and then run next part putting the elements together and then hopefully by around march next year middle of march next year i'll be completing all the distances brick to brick to brick and and going for the swim the ride the run so then on a day the drilling's going to kick in and i'm going to be able to do them all in theory i can do the 400 meter swim i can do the 18k run i can do the 5k ride no, nope, other way around. I can do the 18K ride and the 5K run. Just gotta pull it together. The gym, have I got back in the gym yet? Yes, I have got had a gym session. There was a bit of tension in my muscles. Uh, I ended up with a slight, slight tear on my left calf. Nothing spectacular. It feels more like cramp than anything. Nothing more to worry about. But that, that's, that's that. Uh, shoulders. I mean, I, didn't, I need to work back on getting my shoulders back up. Obviously, after breaking the elbow, it just affected me quite badly. People, this is what I'm on with. Again, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for being a supporter. Press the bell, that's probably there or there. And subscribe, and every week or so, you'll get an update on how my training is going or where my travels have took me. Because there's a few travel videos coming. I know that COVID is just literally locking down the country again but the travel videos will be next year. And I'm hopefully, fingers crossed, got one coming up around the Christmas time. But we'll wait and see. You know, people, I need to get scooting to get to this place here. I've got work to do. People, subscribe, follow, thank you. Friday morning, on the back, getting the train done. I'm actually wearing a jumper today. Crazy. All I'm gonna do is gonna push. I'm running a 9k today. Once I get the 9k done, I'm gonna strap the old feet in and give it a good effort. See what I can send my watts up to. I think, you know, GCN, I think they're doing like 950, touching a thousand each. I'll give it a go, see if I can get out of that high.